This film on neonatal care talks about newborn babies and ways to keep them hale and healthy. Do you know about half of child deaths occur in the neonatal period that is within 28 days after birth? Two third of the infant deaths are neonatal deaths. 56% of neonates die by day 3 and 73% by day 7. care during first week by the anm is crucial for both mother and child care of the baby at birth a healthy baby starts breathing moves its arms and legs and starts crying right away wipe its mouth and nose with a clean cloth to help the mucus drain keep the baby's head lower than its body Give the baby to the mother right away. Put a clean cloth around both of them. Do this as soon as possible so the baby stays warm. It also helps to strengthen the emotional bond between the mother and the baby. Put the baby to the mother's breast immediately. When the baby sucks, the mother's womb tightens and stops the bleeding. This will also help the placenta come out more quickly. Tie and cut the cord only when it turns white and stops pulsing. Weigh the baby. A normal baby should weigh 2.5 kilos. Regular monthly weight gain is the most important sign of a child's overall health and development. Keep the baby dry and clean. It is not necessary to bathe the baby for the first 7 days. Give the baby massage and fumigation. Talk, play with the baby. Immunize the child. Immunization is one of the most important and cost-effective interventions that health systems can provide and is essential to save children's lives. BCG is given to the baby immediately after birth or within a week after its birth. Three doses of DPT and polio drops are administered with an interval of one month. The first dose is given at the age of six weeks. After completion of nine months, the child should be vaccinated against measles and also given vitamin A solution. Vitamin A solution is given up to the age of 3 years with an interval of 6 months. It is safe to immunize a sick child. Baby's nutrition. Breast milk alone is the best possible food a child will ever have in the first 4 to 6 months of its birth. All substitutes including cow's milk, milk powder and cereal gruels are inferior. Breast milk and particularly colostrum, thick yellow milk secreted on the first 2 to 3 days after delivery are rich sources of vitamin A for infants. Breast milk helps to protect the baby against diarrhea, coughs and colds and other common illnesses. The protection is greatest when breast milk alone is given to the baby during the first 4 to 6 months danger signs for the baby at birth the first few days are crucial for the baby's survival it requires extra care a baby must begin to breathe on its own within 2 to 3 minutes after the cord becomes white or the placenta separates from the womb wall if the baby does not start to breathe it can suffer serious brain damage or die what to do clear the baby's mouth and nose and firmly rub its back and feet if the baby still does not start to breathe do rescue breathing lay the baby on a hard surface like a table or the floor open the baby's throat by tilting her head back slightly 
put your mouth over the baby's mouth and nose and gently blow little puffs of air into the baby blow about 30 puffs per minute which is a little faster than you breathe when resting let the baby breathe out between puffs remember the new baby's lungs are very delicate if you blow too hard you will damage them blow little puffs of air from your cheeks and not from your chest the baby's belly and chest will rise and fall with each breath if the belly stays up it means that air is going into the baby's stomach not its lungs try changing the position of the head make sure nothing is blocking the throat a baby born before 8 months is born too early a baby that weighs less than 2500 grams or 5 pounds is born too small these babies need special care treatment dry the baby with a warm clean cloth immediately after birth put the naked baby against the mother's body cover the baby with many warm cloths or blankets make sure the head is covered and the room is warm put the baby to the mother's breast small babies need to nurse at least every 2 hours do not bathe the baby it must stay warm what to do take the baby to a health center or hospital right away baby care make sure the mother knows that breastfeeding is the best food for her baby keep the baby with the mother so it can suck the breast and stay warm encourage the mother to keep the baby warm and clean and to let it suckle as often as it likes care of the cord keep the cord stump on the baby clean and dry with every diaper change it will turn black and fall off during the first week you do not need to cover it with anything unless there are flies or dust then you can use a very clean piece of gauze or cloth to cover it loosely if you notice redness or pus around the cord the baby may have an infection the baby should be seen by the anm and be given antibiotics right away newborn babies have amazing abilities yet they are completely dependent on others for every aspect feeding warmth and comfort